You can create professional looking emails such as this right here with pictures, clickable buttons and more, or you can just go ahead and send out simple text based emails too. I'm going to show you how to do both of them in this video. Now the software I'm using in this video is called system.io. You can get started with it for absolutely free, but it does everything you need to do to run an online business, including email marketing. So go and check it out with the link in the description or that first comment. I've got a bunch of free bonuses that I'm going to throw at you when you get started with system.io. But this is the newsletter dashboard. I'm over here under the emails tab, clicking on newsletters, and we're just going to create a brand new newsletter. So we'll enter our subject name. It's got our sender name and our email address there. And then we get to select whether or not we want to use the visual editor or the classic editor. I usually go with just the classic editor, but I'm going to show you how to use the visual editor right now as well. And we'll just pick one of these templates and go with it. Hit save. And now I see that newsletter right here. Click on that and it'll open it up. Now, before we get into all of these other settings right here, all of these other tags and available options, I want to talk about the editor because this is the visual editor and all you have to do to edit the newsletter is to click on it. So we'll click on it and that's going to pop open the editor and now we can change whatever we like. You can play around with this existing template or you can just delete everything and add your own content. So over here on the left side, we've got image, text, button, horizontal line, you can add sections and put columns as well. So you can go and change this up however you like. Let me go and switch out the logo. And you see this will pop better if I had this in black, so I can change it to black pretty easily. Again, you can go and just delete sections that you're not going to need. If I want to get rid of this entire section, I can do that. Start from scratch and start to build out this email further. Maybe put an image there. Now you can also edit what it would look like on the mobile version. So down here, hit this little cell phone looking option and you can see what that email is going to look like in mobile. So make sure you definitely optimize for mobile and for desktop. Once you get everything set up just the way you like, let me add a button here just for reference sake. You can add and edit this button. Click here to get started and I can make it bigger, wider, change the font you know, make it fill up the whole entire area, check it out on mobile. How does it look? Everything looks great. Then I'll just hit save changes and that will be done. So the visual editor is perfect for businesses that want to send a branded looking email, something that is tailored specific to them and their style that want to send a visual appealing and highly engaging type of email. Me personally for newsletters, I really like to stick to the classic editor. So I switched over to the classic editor here. And the reason I prefer the classic editor, number one, it's just easier and simpler to just send text-based emails. And you can also include pictures and links and stuff like that using the classic editor. So if you, for me, when I send a newsletter, I'm sending a quick communication to my subscribers. So there's really no need to be elaborate or go overboard with pictures. I just want them to know what's going on right then in that moment. So I've got a YouTube video that I'm about to release and I'm going to send a quick newsletter to let my subscribers know that they can go and check out that video. I've already written something down here. All right, we got our subject, our preview, and then we have our quick little email here. I'm just going to go in and link my YouTube video. So I'll highlight that text, hit that link, paste, then I like to bold it out as well. And then down here, I've got another call out. Don't forget to get my system.io bonuses. So I want to link something there too. Hit that link button, paste this in there, and I'll bold that out too. And this simple email is ready to go. Again, if you want to, you can add a picture in here. So for example, I will go and insert the thumbnail for my YouTube video. And I can link the video here as well, so that that'll link back to the video. And now we can test it and see if it looks good uh, when it comes through. So I'll just save it and test it. I'll send it to my email. And I'll wait for that to come in. So here's the email. The links are clickable. The picture is clickable. Let me see if I can get a better look at it. Here you go, guys. I'll show it in mobile too, how it looks in mobile so that you can get an idea of what your newsletters will look like both on desktop and on mobile. So now that we know the email is looking good, we can move on into the settings. I can add an attachment if I like. And the contact settings is what's really important here. This is where we're going to identify who do we want to receive this email. So we have the option to send emails only to contacts who are registered over a certain amount of days. And then we can include tags and exclude tags. So if I wanted to send this to anyone that has a tag of affiliate, 
in my contact list, they will be the only ones to receive this email. If I want to exclude anyone that has the Amazon opt-in tag, I'll just select that. So anyone with a Amazon opt-in tag will not receive my email, even if they are tagged with this. So if you're running multiple businesses or have different landing pages and email campaigns and different tags, you can choose to include them or exclude them and get really specific with who is receiving your email. So for this newsletter, I'm going to select all of my tags so that everyone gets notified of my new YouTube video. And then lastly here, we have the available personalization substitutes. You can just copy this little script here. If you collected any of this information, the last name, country, city, street, if you collected any of this information when they opted in and became a contact, you can then just copy these little scripts in red and paste them into your email and they will auto populate. All right, guys, everything is looking good and ready to send. Now we have the option to schedule it as well. If we want to schedule it for a different time, we can do that. But right now I'm just going to save it and send it right now. So I'm going to hit confirm and that newsletter will be sent. All right, that got sent off, 2,600 emails sent. So far, 8% have opened, 212 opens, and only one click so far, but it's only been a minute. There you go, guys, easy and quick email marketing using system.io. Go and grab yourself a free trial if you choose to upgrade to a paid plan. I've got a lot of bonuses that I can offer you, but system.io is a great software that anyone can use to build a business online to start making money online. Go and check it out with the links in the description. My name is John. EverydayFBA.com is the website, and I'll catch you guys on that next one. Peace.